Hey everyone, Son of Beast and Terry Crews here. This is NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs 24 on EA Sports. Hey everybody, it's Boomer. Welcome to another Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. This is day two, and right now we start things off here for the first part of the game. This matchup, as we're about to be finding out who is going to take the next one in and win the whole thing. Well, this all comes down to all the bunch of the games that comes in between the Carolina Hurricanes and the Philadelphia Flyers. Flyers haven't won each game already, but as for the regular season, they lost against the Anaheim Ducks in the shootout. But this moment is going to be it. Will the Flyers win the game? Or will the Hurricanes shut them down here in a shutout first round of the game? You'll find out soon enough if there's a choice in between. Now I send you over down to the other side as Test Tube is standing by along with Fan and the third commentary of the crew. All there does to turn for one. It's all what you can definitely just say is welcome to the show. Ultra Beast. And the center ice of this game will be Son of Beast. I'll be back with Rose Game Show after this. Now enjoy the first game of day two of game four, Hurricanes and the Flyers. Let's send you down to Wallace Fargo Center as sending him by starts in for test two. Guys, all yours. See you later. What's up everyone? It's test two. It's time to find out who wins this next game. This is Eddie Jones, coverage of the Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports. Here we are, Wells Fargo Center, let's find out who wins. The puck is set and we are underway now. As a starting for the group, we have a Svechikov given again to Abo. Here's Burns, he will now find over to Slavin. Slavin now finding again to Abo. Trying to get back over to Svechikov. Takes a shot. York takes a puck steal. Forster with the puck back the other way. Here's Lacton. Loses the puck as now Sebastian Ago will have it over. In a raging offense on the other side. Now finding over. The back to Slavin. And that puck steal takes over Svechikov. He gives it again to Burns. Burns now finds Slavin shot. This one's deflected and the puck is loosed out of the, ch out of the chain and now finding again is Ago. Hurricanes are back in the offense zone. Give a good look again to Burns. Burns in the backhand. This one has been blocked up in traffic. Here's Farley. He will hand it over now again to St. Hines. St. Hines went down. That brutal play is going to be like a little change up to the worst. Not even anybody's liking the favor call. Ago takes the puck steal and Turbine will have it over. The puck has been bad pass now. Best will have it now over again. Finding Bunting. Crowd chanting, let's go Flyers. Back again to Sketchy. Here's a take. Boating shot. Saved by Arson. This will be his first save of the night with only 17.04 to go. Along with me, Fan, and Ultra Beast, no snore to game in game four. And as right now, as Sketchy wins the face off. Ooh, that's a little bit broken up play here. Well, you're not going to get it successfully easy enough. You know, the harder it comes in is a transferring to make this update on the run. You don't want that one to get out of the way. You're going to need to have a lot of time to go with some practice. You need to settle it down, take some time, and do it over again. He needs a lot of practices to go with the pass in between. Recovered by Hurricanes. Bunny with the puck. Moves it quickly. Walker takes the puck steal. And that gets in with the puck. Near in the corner, now finding room to Walker. Shot. Saved by Kochikov. Here's Bunny on the wing. Fires it around the net, now finding again to, Bur to Jury. Jury battling along for the puck. Now it's Hathaway with the puck. Looking over again, now finding a spin move in. Breaks it up a broken play. Here's Skedgy. We'll have a chance now over again to Jarvis. Jarvis and the Solstice pass to Martin. He's all alone. Oh, he 
lost that one, this one goes out of the zone. Oh, that would have been like a hard one to take. If he would have had that great goal, that would have been a perfect chance to have the start lead for the Hurricanes. This was a game set ready for a face-off. Flyers wins the face-off. Oh, there's a big hello moment there. Now, they're not really nice at all. I don't know what to take them all of it. Look, but this hard offense can't let that one stop. What a save here by Urson. This one's pretty good. Now, they're off to do another one again. Flyers are looking to see if they can get a win in the fourth game. They've lost three skins in a row, and they need to try to find some helps to get back into the group. There's no way they can get the offense done until they have it all finished. Hurla! What a save by Urson with the glove release! If you're all waiting for tonight's game, we have a first game that's coming underway in Nashville, Tennessee. We've got the Predators and the Stars here at Bridgestone Arena. That will be happening here at 8 o'clock p.m. Following along with the later tonight game at 10.30 p.m., it will be the Kings facing against the Vancouver Canucks at Crypto.com Arena. Be sure to catch you all year around here by watching it down here on the playoffs and the completion of the postseason right all year round on YouTube and check them out on Sun Beast. Don't forget to subscribe to his channel. He's got a lot of adventure ways that's going to be happening on his channel. And coming soon will be a new reaction video. That will be all you know it. It's Best Investor. Well, I never go to what Best Investor is, but you'll see what happens here if there's another new changing in the way. I can find another one and try to leave it off with the pressure zone. Now he finds Burns. First shot! And this one's deflected off, but it's recovered by Spetchikov. Terra Mining gives it back to Slavin. Slavin gives it again to Burns. Make new line change. Give again to Terra Mining. Shot! What? Svechikov tries to recover the puck. And they are on the full attacking range. Svechikov. Great puck moving here for the Hurricanes as they keep moving the puck in back and forth. It's good now. Don't let them keep on handling it. There is a problem. Slavin shot. That's blocked. And this one goes back to Forster the other way. Burns will have that puck here as Carolina's back in the offense. Looks a pass, finds Slavin! Oh my goodness! That went over the net! And that one stayed out of the zone. Oh, that would be a hard one to take here. I never saw that coming here before. That blocked again. Slavin will try to regroup the puck as it leaves the zone and now finding again to Kalkinemi. Here's the pass that knows it. Doesn't able to get it that time. And that gets him with the puck. And that was broken up. Oh, there's a little bit of punch out here for Stahl. But you know it's easy now because Stahl was really over it. Trying to get that one out of the way for sure. That can give you a hard thing to go for. Backhander stopped again by Kuchikov. And there's a penalty call on cross checking. That's going to be a first penalty call on Philadelphia. Well, there's a problem now. He cross-checked on the Hurricanes. It's not their way to start their day off in game number four. You don't make that one clear. You have that one to get right back in the zone. And that's a hard check. You can't that one. You can't push it over to the wall. That's going to be a hard one to take. Here's the call. We have the Sun of Beast standing by. Sebastian Alba was one of his ultimately he has his third eye ability. He's taking a lot of chances right now if he wants to get this thing over in between. Their other offense can definitely try to pick up their looking open if they find an open room. I'll find out if Sebastian Alba has his third eye right in between. Back to you. Pop leaves his own as Nekis will got that one in possession and now he will give off to Sageji. He finds Bunning. Bunning on a one on one. Oh, making switch! What a save by Urson! Urson got really good at keeping it high on the skittle. This range off is not going to keep on coming down if he gets it. Now here's the pass over to Skedgy. Skedgy went down. Poling trying to give up the San Heim. 8 3 left to go in the first period. One minute remaining in the Carolina power play. Jarvis sends it over now again to Bunning. Bunning behind the cage. He will find it over to Nekes. On the backhander! What a save! Oh man, Ursin made that for a close call! What a stop! Oh man, I love Ursin. That reaction is starting to be a quick on time save. It's not going to be easy enough. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. 
Now Drury wins the face off as Stahl will clip it out. Ferns recovers the puck. Pressure's on for the Hurricanes, but Katez will take the puck away and will fire it out. Carolina back in the offensive zone. And a big pass broken up. So looks like his time's almost about to expire. And a full man range is on as the power play comes to an end for Carolina. A one in the fourth game. Now they've really been turning to be all over it now. I was wondering what they were gonna do next. Because they were trying to play off the playoff mode. They, they really would they should have had that one counted right away. It may not be what they're looking for, but you may got a point already if you have that one in possession. It's not what anybody's thinking of, but they are really been stepping it up to each other. They are really like battling it out. Along the game, it doesn't work like to anybody who gets that one played out of position. Here's the pass. Nelson shot and blocker stopped made by Urson. Turn line and regroups the puck. Give again to Drury. Finds Dershikov shot. Save off by Urson. And Urson's going to cover the puck up with just 5.52 left to go. Easy does it, easy go. That was just save the puck again. Hurricanes wins the faceoff. Stingy! Glove saved by Urson. 5.45 left to go in the first period. Still a lot of time left. And if you're all looking for our next game of the NBA playoffs, Game 3 is underway to get you covered up here so you can watch any time right now. And it will be underway there soon. With the first game that will be happening here will be the Magic and Knicks at the Garden. Following along with the next game is the Bucks against the Heat at the Kaseya Center. That will be the next one coming in at 1 p.m. and 3.30 p.m. for each games of the game. Then following along with the later tonight's game at 8 will be the Mavericks and the Clippers at American Airlines Center. And 10.30 will be the Suns versus the Timberwolves here at, you know the name, it all calls for one of you that you all can count on at Phoenix, Arizona. Footprint Center. That will be all games here, only on Sun and Beast. Money, what a shot! Take two rebounds! It's saved by Usain! That was pretty good enough. Hard to attempt out there. They were really been dominating it off. A lot of time left in this period. Still no score in the game in the first period. Hurricanes wins the face off and pass gives to Jarvis. Jarvis lost that control. And Stahl. He goes down. He ties with the puck down fine half away. On his way toward the inbound. Pest went down. Give again to Skedgy. Here's Stahl. Sending it over to Jarvis and now finding Marnik. Here's a look for Jarvis. Oh, that cut them down. Didn't go in. And Pest. Shoots. What a stop by Usain. Rebound play it again. Oh, they're really like on to a hard feeling. This one is not going to be always a favorite if that one's going to be in here a long night. He goes down after him, says, knock it off now, it's mine. Oh, don't be aggressive, but there is another takeover. He would tip the kick. Another hurricane battle defenseman wants to get out of the way. Oh, there's a payback. You know what happens now? They don't like to call the mess things over all the time. 2.21 left to go in the first period after an icing whistled on Carolina. Back in possession will be Philadelphia. Boom, blocked down by Nosen. Chester Fast on a one-on-one -on -one fast break will try to deliver it over around the corner. And Kennedy with the puck. Take it and cut! His way has been stopping in for the traffic defender. Chatfield lost that puck, killed by an open man. Harvey has it over. Here's a shot, way wide, and stopped by Kukkenemy. Kachikov, excuse me. Now Orlov could the hit here, and Bunny with the rebound. Looks it over, now find Kukkenemy. One minute remaining in the first period, and stopped by Ersen. We're in a minute left to remain in the first period, still trying to find a score between the Flyers and the Hurricanes. Now they're ready to do their face-off. Flyers wins the face-off. 
You're giving it to Farby. Trying to battle it. Rolls around the Forrester shot. Club saved by Kachikov. He's going to hold on with just only 34 seconds in the first period. It's always a good hand though. Just try to keep that one in there and you just got to make sure you have it all set. Hurricanes wins the face off and now Bunning. Trying to hold on to it. Jury trying to take the attack, now finding Slavin. Here's Bunning on his attempt to get the goal. Oh, what a slap by Erson. He's really like all into dominance performance. He's like already a big, okay, I'll take down. Here's a coup as right now Sebastian Sean Katori will take a chance here for the second period after this. And the win puts for Shechikov. Will stop by Ersen. Sebastian Ajo is one of his third eye ability that takes all of his chance with this lineup. His group can always take the offensive work on their, on their way up. But even Sean Katori will have his own with his percentage, but he will find someone that can try to take it all. These two I'm watching over here, and I'll be trying to find out if there is another takeoff right in between. Back to you. Period's complete, but it's even up. We'll get to the second period when we come back. Welcome back to the Stanley Cup Playoffs as we're ready to start the second period. And off we go, we're ready to get this thing started. All ice is freshed up and we are ready. I'll have a take over here for in between of Ultra Beast and Fan. Let's have your guys with a recap of the first period. They've been really wild doing this offense. I was really was hoping that there was a great chance for them they could they could top that score. They have an early range in the lead. They done really well on their chance of their timing of the angle. But sometimes they, they didn't really think they wanted to do this one at uh, all the all the luck of their what we're doing. But let's find out if they do have some. Because we'd really love to see that one coming in fast. Yeah, you know what? I always agree. Let's hope that they are putting him in the offensive stride of the effort. Stop here by Kutchikov. He's fighting Ago on a one-on-one! Shoots! Way wide! Slavin now fighting again to Spetchikov. Takes a spin! Shoots! Save again by another great defenseman by Ersin. Forcer now finds again a lap in. Two-on-one opportunity. Padded up the save here by Kutchikov. And now we'll have to clear the puck out. Now finding again the Drury. Drury pass. Ooh, that one's a little bit too soon. Puck stay alive as Bunny will have it over. That pass to Nekes. Can't hold on to the puck. Farby waiting on his way down toward the other side. Now find Lefton. Takes a big spill. Bunny has that puck now finding again the Drury. Drury trying to hold up in the passing zone. Nekes. Got the puck behind the net. Looks again to Skedji, and Pesh, shoots, save, York with a block shot. That one's not going to happen now because they really are trying to pick it up there. They are showing a lot of offense that they can't do on their own hit. They just need to make sure they have the timing go right. Now Nekis will find it over again. The pass is broken up as Drury will have it handled. Meyernet tried to give over. Ersin's going to cover it up, not find Sanheim. Now he finds it over to Frosty, gives it Atkinson. Atkinson trying to roll it in, trying to put the inbound back to Sanheim again, trying to Frost. And there's the penalty call. That goes the other way for the Carolina Hurricanes. Oh boy, they never love that. Chatfield is in a penalty box, and this is not what the day is. They can't let that one get right from it. First penalty, called up here on Philadelphia, but now, the second penalty, the first one goes out to Carolina. Now the way to start their power play off for the fourth game. And off they go. Slavin. Clear the puck out in the Flyers zone. Now Erson will have it over now trying to find room again. Brink went down again and he said, nope, not my time. Saw lost the puck and York will have it again to Forster. He finds now again the frost. Here's Farby. That puck loses it, and he went escaping the zone and now find Brink. And here's Forster. Forster, work his way in. Stop again by Kutchikov. Jarvis went down. 
Frank try to hold on. Ballet on the board, now we'll try to fire it out. And Sullivan flipping over itself. They're really our battling again. They can't let that one lose at all. And here's Forster. Works his way around, now find Farby. Farby, in the middle, find Frost. Hold on with the puck, this Slavin will have it here with 30 seconds. And that puck can't hold on. Frost got it down back to the other side. Down to the middle. This one has been chopped up and broken. Lapped in. Shot and saved by Kutchikov. He's ready to get out there. And the time has already been expired for the Flyers. 0-1 oh, on the other side for the start of the second period. You know, it's a great saving at that point. Nevertheless, they really are looking like they really are comfortable there. But that position is not going to be easy enough that they can try to handle it through. They're really working it out that hard. I know they're trying to like keep that one out of sight, but let's be let's be honest. They really are getting away with that. Lapped in. Poked it up by Skeggy. Good defensive separate and now back to Nozin. Nozin. Shot! Saved by Usain! Oh man! Just 12 minutes remaining. And we're ready for another face-off. But Krasinski and we're back the other way. Pass, now finally get the Skeggy. Skeggy shot, close save by Erson. We're under 12 minutes remaining in the second period. Still a lot of time left in the period, but we're hoping to find out there's another goal take. Now the Flyers will win the faceoff. On the other side, now finally again New York. York makes his way down here toward the right side of his own. He goes bang and hit. And a shot. Almost took it in there, but it's punch a cop with the save. This really had to be like a hard one to take over. I know it's not very clear, but the easier way is that he is trying to put up a lot of a great stopping inbound on the save. This inbound is a critical way to make that one play pay for. He really can't let that one get away with that one in there in between. You're hoping you have a good target to get over it. Now he finds Drury shot. Shoots! Save it up here again by Ersing. And Ersing covers up the puck here in the midway mark of the period. What an excellent save on that game. Now you know Ersing just made that one really clear. He got a great use of the skill. Edging closer down in the second period. It's still no score in the game, still zero. Carolina wins the faceoff. Now find Chatfield's shot. That goes blocking back to Drury again. Denekis over to Olaf. Puck back again. Denekis over again to Drury. Shot! Stop again here by the blocker by Erson. Erson makes his way now, finding over to Bunting. But he gives to Denekis and now he gets to Orlov. Orlov shot! Lost saved again by Erson. They were really doing really well. You know, I was not even as sure if the person was going to try and, like, save it all. Jordan Stahl wins the faceoff. He's off to Orlov. Orlov gets to Jarvis. Jarvis moves inside. What a save here by Ersin. Now he finds it again. Orlov tries to work his own time with another move, finding Stahl. Stahl shot. That's blocked it away. Lapped him with the puck now, finding it way down or over the other side. He goes down and Mario takes a puck steal. There's a lot of great attacking out there. I mean, they're really working it off. But they can't let that one lose their control if he can get there through. Here's Chatfield. Now finds it again to Orlov. Orlov to the backhand. What a save by Ersin. Oh man, a great chance for the Hurricanes to get the lead. Now a lot of time is left for me inside of the period, still in the flying zone. 8.21 to go in a second. Now they win again. Here's Chatfield. Shot! That was wide and it goes right off the glass. And Chatfield recovers it. Nelson gets off to Orloff. Orloff can't hold on. Here he comes in the fast break. Oh man, he will dump that one out. And Nozin will have it over again. Now finally again to Kalkedemi. He's all alone. Shoots. 
save! Unbelievable! That was going to take a lot of time. That was a very close call. What a great chance here for the goaltender. Saul wins another face-off. Chatfield trying to look it over. And we'll have to reset it up here, and now we'll give it over now again to Orlov. He guides it over to Chatfield, now find a pass to Smetchikov. Smetchikov trying to race it forward, and his shot stopped again here by Urson. He has it over now, Burns to Slavin. Slavin gives it again. Ago trying to hold on to it. Here he comes. Score! Sebastian Ajo brings their team up. It's now a 1-0 game. Watch the cut move and bound. That one's going to take a lot of timing to get in between. He was going to trip over, but that was a little late on that call. Sebastian Ajo made a great move. He finally had that ducking in. That is a great chance that the Hurricanes are picking up their run of the steam. You know what's easy now, Sebastian Nago has been really going over it for his tight angle. He's nothing to quit here, but he's really onto it for another chance of his ability run to keep that alive. He's playing it for so long and he wants to get that one done. That stopped by Kutchikov. And there's a broken glass right behind the net. Gonna have to replace a new one. Oh, there's a lot of paybacks in between. Are you kidding? Yeah, that's a big banger over there. Hit the helmet, that means an ouch. Yeah, definitely gonna have to send him off a bill. That pain in a glass, that's a pain in someone else's way. Yeah, I wouldn't even encounter that one in there at Ultra Beast. If there's something that happens, I mean, I, I really would say is, gotta replace a new one. <laughs> Take all the time, replace a new glass, don't let anybody get hurt. No, no cutting blister. Oh boy, the delay penalties called on Philadelphia. And now any extra skaters on as they will try to MDA down during the lineup. Yeah, it's a bad idea because he made up with a slashing call. It's not very easy when he's been doing this. It's a better way to have that one stayed out, but that one was no use of it. Sean Walker's a little bit unhappy with him, but he's not really paying it off. And he's been like, you know what? I don't know why the call is on me for. That's a big concern about him. Second penalty kill on Philadelphia Flyers. That's right now the Hurricanes are entering the power play. Flyers wins the faceoff. Zeeler past the puck and Taravainen will clear the puck out. And here's pulling. Spin around to control it. Save and off by Tartikov. Nose it up again. Tries to deliver and now finally get a Drury shot. Backhand saved by Urson. He's over, going to hold on with the puck with under five minutes remaining in a second. Now the win for the Fall Hires, and he will give it back to Sennheim, and the puck will lose the control out. Kitez with the puck, can't hold on with the skate. Jarvis with the puck right now, finding inside, boring shot! Loved again by Ursen. He's really well into it now. I mean, Urson is not going to stop here. He's really got to make sure he's up for a challenge. Now they're ready to do another face-off. One nothing to score for the Sebastian Alvo on, their, on its way with a backhand score in a second. Yurk will clear the puck out. Under a minute to go for the Kings power play. As Skedgy will have it over to Nekis. Now he gives off the Bunny. Fires it around the net, back to Jarvis. Gives it Nekis. Looks again, Skedgy on the backhand. That one's off the glove and it goes right back behind the bounds. Nekis tries again to Skedgy. Gives it Nekis and now finding Jarvis. Looks now over. Great puck movement here for the Hurricanes as they keep it going back and forth. Shot! Way off the mark and another big save. He's ready to get back out there. Another one for our Nekis. Can't find an open look, and the power play is over. They really are doing really well. This offense is not going to keep on stopping it down because they really like to keep on pucking it, moving it in and out. It's not what they always do for it. They've got to make sure they have a good open connection for you from the outside of it range and in the attacking zone. This is a lot of helpful for the players that can play in the inbound for their offensive skill. 
This lineup is not going to be easy enough if you try to take over. Pesh now finds sketchy shot. Prior to deflect it in there, but it stayed out. The Flyers are back in an offensive zone. Skechikov takes a steal. He's on the way. And Puck Smith broke it up. 2-3 left to go in the second period. He finds a look. Farley trying to hold on. Good takeaway by Sebastian Ago as he gives it to Pess. And that one won't take it from here. Walker finds Zeller. Zeller finds Frost. Frost trying to cut him back to tip it. Shot! So what a great stop inbound. But no big save here. That's a hard one that goes in. It's a prior inbound, but you just gotta keep on saving the puck right away. That big reaction is gonna be a hard one to take. That puck can't go leave him over. Buddy now finding Burns. Great puck movement, but it's not the way. Final minute remaining in the second period as we're done, we're almost done to the finish before the third period. Burns now finds Slavin. Slavin gets to Bunning. Cross takes the puck away. Alley for the loose chain here as Atkinson rebounds the puck. 30 seconds. That went wide. Back to Slavin again. Watching out for a collision. And Bunning gives it again. Tries to give up to Burns. Burns trying to get to Slavin. Shot blocked. York with the rebound. Will take his time, shot it, and way wide. Two periods complete, only one goal puts Sebastian Navo a take one nothing. Third period is next after this. You're watching the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports. We're ready to start the third period in Philadelphia. Win or go home for Philadelphia Flyers. Let's find out if they take it off. It's been a wild one for the game as I send you now over to the two of you guys. Let's have your takes for the second period recap. They really are working on all far. I know when the, the Home Kings are finding a way open look, but here's a good uh, suggested feeling that Sebastian Ago had made that backhander in there for a lot of great chance. It's a lot of picking up saves in this game, but not for long. It does happen to be one of them now, Hopefully there might be a ranging to shut them down and finish it off. Well, hopefully there might be another way they can get there. Let's hope they can get it through. On a start right now, as the pass is broken up, here's Lacton. Off to Forrester! Oh, Kuchikov in a save! But another big inbound with under 18.30 to go. A lot of time left in this period. Philadelphia trail by one. Now the Flyers wins it. Oh, I think it's a smackdown, but no penalty called on Carolina. Here they come. Oh, Tara Vinan would have got that goal to take over after Sebastian Ivo. And a save puts in by Ersay. Well, the bad timing is not really turning out to be good enough for Sebastian Ivo. He should have had that when they get his, uh, his timing and before the goal, and you know it. That one put in a shock and awe moment. It could be a save, or it could be a goal for Ursa. That's a close call in the range. Now here's Tippett. That fires a shot, and gloves saved by Kochikov. And now he has it over to get a Drury. Drury will now find Bunning. Off to Drury. The puck is moving around the middle. Finds Nekis. Backhander stopped again. Drew, he tried to hold on. And here's Burns. Save! That stays out! Slavin, now find Drury. Looks again to Slavin. Slavin can't hold on with the puck. Here comes Atkinson. Atkinson to shoot! And an R1 stop again by Kuchikov. 16.22 to go in the third period. Still a lot of time left before it comes down to the end of a regulation. Now they're ready to do another face-off. Just 16.22 to go. Philadelphia wins the face-off. Walker, Sealer, shoots it. Deflector doesn't go in. Marina, try to hold on with the puck. Ranging in sight. Finds again to Jarvis. Jarvis, and that pass broken up by Pulling. Here's another take for Pulling. 
takes a wink to Hoppe, Stahl takes a rebound. There's a lot of happy attackers there. I mean, there's a knockoff range. Got to keep an eye on that. But don't get too uncomfortable if you're going to take over it because that's going to be like a hard take. Hathaway will not find over to Walker. And he just lost that one here. And it's sketchy with the puck. Looks it again to pass. Pass fires around the net. Now finding a looking open offense. Zeeler's got the puck. And Stahl will have it here. Now the team goes back into the offensive zone in the Flyers territory. Doing for two. Stahl! Not enough to get there as Urson grabs a rebound and holds on with just only 14, 17 to go. Now here's another call, Andrei Svechikov. Svechikov is one of his skilled up ability of his challenge. He ultimately has going with a lot of takeovers in between. It's not what their offensive does, it takes a lot of worthy note privy credit on next level. The higher range is a higher percentage to take over. Let's find out if Svechikov has it in. Back to you. Now Lapton will have it over. Loses the puck and it goes back to Forster. Terramini takes the puck steal. Puck steal in the zone as Svechikov will have a dish off. Orlov shot. Blocked by Walker. Now Walker, Walker just made that one here. Since playing with the Kings already, but he didn't really think he was going to like take a lot of handle in that pressure. That zone is going to like take a hard look in between. That one's blocked again. Denies that one. Try to go around again to the deck. Senai! Oh, you've gotten pretty pressured here. Orlov spins again. Chatfield! Block the shot! What a takeover! But he now finds Orlov. And Orlov goes slammed down right toward the board. Holds on to the puck. Here's Nekis. Gives again to Drury. Fires a shot! That one the game here, and he lost that stick. Bunnings going to have to replace a new one. And now Farby will have it over. He will clear the puck out. Now here's another take for the, for the Hurricanes as he gets it off to Chesper Pack. Whoa! That is a big hit in the center ice. Wow, that is like a hit. Are you seriously going to take over or down? Give me some break. That fired off the net, and York will have it again to tip it. Tip it. Works his way across. Lost that puck and Slavin will have it. Slavin will dish it out clear. York with the puck. Tries to give off to Atkinson. And Atkinson can't hold on with the puck. Doc Kennedy finds again the facts. Tries to look over it. Spins across. Now finds Burns. Burns gives it over. Knows him and has lost that puck. Takes a pushback. Sanheim trying to hold it over. Oh, that one takes a big hello by Burns. And here he comes. Oh, that one's another hit over there. Big hit collision here. Let's get physical. There's a lot of big attackers in Philadelphia. I know. It's really going to be like a hard one to take. I mean, nobody's going to even get used to this. You have to stop them down. After all sides called on Philadelphia Flyers, still a one nothing game past the midway mark. And Hurricanes wins the faceoff. Here's Stahl. We'll try to leave it off the mark as Jarvis has the puck. Holding, moving his way down. We'll not get this thing straight as Stahl will have it over. Hurricanes back in the offense zone. Now find Burns. Here again to Martinette. Good puck over, but Martinette still holds on. With a shot! It's another block shot! Stahl will now have it over on the other side. Tries to look over. Stahl holds on. Here's Hathaway. Send me the shot. That was wide. Another take for Martinette. Here's Burns. Burns spins around. Blocked. Holy will have his own chance. And Terramine with the puck. Marnuk will have it recovered. Try to look for some help as Press will give it up to Sketchy. Fire save by Ursin. 7 16 left to go in the third period. They're really like are having a hard time. Oh, they gotta get over this one here instead. Crowd wants some noise as there's still a 1 0 lead for Carolina. 
They win the face off. Good stop again here by Urson. And here comes Farby. Farby loses the putt, and Ango will have it back. Another take to Sebastian Ango. Excuse me, I think Svechikov. Yep, it's Svechikov. And Pesh now finds Skeji. Skeji toward the middle. This one can't get it up to go beat him. Svechikov will try to fire that puck out. Skeji loses the puck range and then goes outside. And Kuchikov will have to give it over now as he gives it Pesh. Here's a take for Ako. Off to Pesh. Here's another one for Bunning. In the corner, 545 left to go. And Skeji with the puck. Still need to find a looking open man for looking for Pesh. Pesh gets to Bunning. Great puck moving. And he scores! Wow! What a deflection! Sebastian Ajo with two goals. You know you say what happened here. That one's going to deflect off of it. Sebastian Ajo had that one cleared earlier, and that range is going to keep it onside going. And that one deflected in there. That's a great communication for the Hurricanes to get on the goal. Then most of the range has to keep an eye on that. I say Urson just really had that one showing. His reaction got really intense, and this was not his day to be in for him. And here's Nekis, now finding over. Here's a look for Pesk, and now finds Skeji. Shot! Locked it up here, no deflection take for Bunning. Under five minutes remaining in the third. He goes down after him. Oh, takes that feedback. Pesk firing around the net. Jury looks to snake this shot, and a big save by, by Ursin. Walker will try to give off to Forster. Forster holds on with no connecting shot and a save by Kunchikov. 4 of 4 remaining in the third period. Looking for another goal for the Flyers. Now the Flyers wins the faceoff. Walker in it. She scores! Now on the goal. It's a 2 1 game. Well, there it is now. John Walker had that one with a great screen effect, and that was going to take a lot of his time. But not to worry, this one takes it over ahead. John Walker had that one with his first game of this period. He's looking to find his perfection to get a tie game of this series. If he doesn't handle it, he has to find another room if he can get that one through. That harder will take him down. It's going to have a hard one to make a save. Let's find out if they can tie that up. Back to you. Puck will leave the zone here with 3 3 left to go. Icing's waved off. Here's another one for Stahl, and he gives it off to Slavin shot. And a glove save by Erson. 3 12 left to go in the third period. 2 1 is the score. Officials are getting set, ready for another face-off. They desperately win the face-off. They really have a hard one to take care of. The Hurricanes are really like a better team. This is their fan favorite, and it looks like they wanted to like try to win it off, but it's not really easy enough to, to try to like let them separate in between those two. Now the Flyers will have their chance with 2.30 to go. Tippett trying to roll it in. Inside the zone. Stop again by Ajo. Burns. Gives again. Svechikov. Skilled it up. Lost that puck. And Walker will have it. The extra standard coming on and just coming down to a 90 second. Lost that puck. Slavin holds it back. Forrester can't hold on with that. He scores! It's a tie game! What do you know? How are you able to make that shot in there for Frost? That is something that you've never seen him going in. But that take was all it took. You know, you saw that one coming in there. I think that one is going to take a close game. Wow. They could be, a, it could be going to overtime. Forster really need a desperate goal. And they are finally having to come back in. 
Here's Sarah Viney now fighting again. Pesk loses the puck. Forster trying to hold on with the puck, and he has his first goal in the playoff game against the Hurricanes. Now York will have it over with one minute remaining in the third. Loses that puck. Pesk will try to hold it on. Game five will be necessary in between for the Flyers and the Hurricanes if they get a next goal for the Flyers. If they win, then we'll head you back to Carolina for the PMC Arena game five. All right, let's have a look in between. Off to you, Son of Beast. I love the way that Sebastian Ago has been really been playing for his depth of goal. And his range out has been turning excellent. He's been working really well. That hard one of defense is not always worthwhile to get that back in. Not for anybody that has that goal, but the option is a better way to be. Here's Bunning. We'll have a now chance again to Drury. Drury finds Bunning. Time is ticking down. Tippett will decide to get the puck to go ahead. And will spin around. Atkinson takes a hit. Drury, Skedgy, and will clear the puck out. Ready for overtime. What a comeback for the Flyers, but we've got our overtime period coming up in just a bit. You're watching the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. It's all right here, next. Let's have a look in between of the games, of the goals, and for some statistic periods in each game. And now a probable matchup in between, guys. Who's your take? Well, it's going to be like a Hurricanes idea. I think they're going to let them win it all, but hopefully we're going to see what they can do if they can try to make a stop out of it for sure. And what is your take over here on the other side there, Ultra? Well, it's really what they say. I say that the Flyers are going to take over this. This probable of the matchup, they never won that game in the playoffs. I'm hoping to bet for them, and it's going to be like a hard one to take. All right, guys, thank you guys so much. Let's get you back on ice. Ready to start overtime. It's finally that time. Ready for overtime. And here we go. Overtime in Philadelphia starts now. First look at the appearance in the Flyers and the Canes. What do you have to say about it, Dave? Well, they've really been doing really well. Every every game is just a hard way to take. But it's not for the option that they have it all coming in. The playable is accepted, but sometimes it's not really easy enough when the Flyers have some more room, they've got their goals back. They really wanted to have that win with a party big time. And Sennheim will have it over. Now on the other side, he gives it to Lapton. Lapton finds Farby. Farby takes it over. Svechikov tries to give it over. Now finding Sebastian Ago. Ago looking over in. Spins again. Wow, what a hit. That's going to be a hard one. That's very painful enough, but don't get uncomfortable. Lockton recovers it. For the win. Oh, Skojakov just had that save again. And the puck's still alive. Near line group now find Nekis. Nekis to win it. Slamming. Blunt save. What a stop by Urson. And just 17.34 to go. Now the fish is ready to get this thing back in ice. It's still a tie game. Next goal wins. Here's a take. Burns. Lost that one. He will now find it over to get a slapping. Shot. Hit the pad off again here by Urson. And back to Forster the other way. Forster can't hold on. Try to watch him bound. Hot stop by Kochikov. Drury looks his way down now fighting Nekis. Nekis with the shot. And it'll win it. And it's still alive. Tippett trying to get back to Sennheim. And now he will try to dish it off. Pesh with the rebound. Here's Bunning. Lost that puck. 16-10 to go in the overtime period. Here's Tippett. Tip it to win it, and that block it saved off again by the goaltender. Deep to know in a Drury. Here comes Marner to win it. Oh, what a save! What a big epic one! That was 
one's a hard one that you can definitely do. Now, I'm playing no exception to this. Orlov now finds again Jarvis back to pitch. Orlov. Look to win it. And this one's blocked. Drury trying to get back to Jarvis. And here's a man going down and said, no, no, I'm not leaving. What a save by Ursay. 14.53 left to go in overtime. Still a lot of time left in this period. With another chance and a win? No. Back stop by Ursin under 14.30. Sorry, 14.50. Still a lot of time left. Still a tie game. And Hurricane spins the face off. And now a big save here on a play. Burns, get to Jarvis. Now by Sleeman. Burns, win it. Oh, it's stopped by Urson. What a big lucky night. Now that's what you always know for Urson. He always shows up. He makes a great stop out of him. But for sure, I don't know how long it takes. It's a great uncomfortable by anybody. And they win. Stayed out. And off to do it again. Here's the tape. Marta blocked. Saw. And her team's still up ahead. Slavin. Burns. Burns can't find a look. He went down. And they're going to have to reinforce the regroup this one here. He goes back the other way. Still in overtime, and this one is, uh, is brought to you by Adidas. And now Jarvis will have it over again to Slavin. Slavin now finding Jarvis. Loses the puck range. Try to pick it up. In the middle. And out of time as this one stopped by the goaltender. Farnock shot. What a save. And Farby will try to clear it out. Here's a tight for the Flyers. Stopped in the corner. Pass. We'll now fire a deep. And we'll have some tired defenders here and they'll come to icing on Carolina. A lot of time left in this period. It's still a tie game. The next one will win the game. And the Hurricanes win the faceoff. And the puck is given. Here's Hathaway. Fires the dumping puck out. And Sketchy will have it over. He finds again a stall. Stall making his way down. Looks to Sketchy. Two of an open room. Enough to get there. Here's Svechikov. To win the game. That one's a lot. A big stick lift here. And here's Kitez. To win it. This one stayed out. Sketchy trying to battle for the puck free. To win the game. That was another big save by Kutchikov. Oh, that horrible in this one. It has to be a lot of great takes in between for Jarvis. That was a lot of hard reception, but this was no joke that he had. When it comes in big right now, you know it's not going to be easy when you take a lot of timing. Now both teams are set ready for the faceoff. Still a tie game. Carolina wins the faceoff. First shot. The backhander. Nice catch. A lot of time left in this period. Still looking for a goal for an overtime. Carolina wins another faceoff. Pass trying to deliver it over to Sketchy. Here's a take for Shechikov. Right toward the corner. Find a pass to Ajo. Ajo giving it over. And then Ajo will have to race it back down the other way. Halfway will have it over. And Sketchy will give it back to Sebastian Ajo. On his way, take. Looks it over. Svechikov, what a stop. Ursin holds on with only under 9-3 to go. Now this one is going to be a lot of taking clean response enough. They're never going to let that one happen to go right in between. They got a lot of hard takes in here. Sebastian Ajo wins the faceoff. Chaffee to dip it in. This one is knocked out. 
Atkinson trying to hold on. Nine minutes to go in the overtime. First period in over, first regulation overtime. And Terabini will have it over now again to Drury. Drury trying to head it over to Orlov. Here comes Terabini. Svechikov recovers the puck. And Chappie will have to hold on to the puck here and way out of the zone. Now they're back in regroup. Walker takes the puck away. Here's Sealer back at Atkinson. Another take for Tippett. Tippett shot! What a blocker stop made by Kuchikov. Bunning now finds Nekis. Nekis has it over now to Orlov. Orlov to win it! And try to fuck it in there, but it didn't work. Chapia will try to move it again to Nekis. Fires a shot! Big save there on the inbound by the goaltender. They really are looking for a goals to take. There's a lot of hard ones to have out with like deception in there. It's not going to be really easy to try to like settle it down. And Drury will have it in here. Looking for some drop and pass. Oh, it was too close to call. No penalty on Carolina. That one's still not a save by Erson. And right now, back the air, wait for the Flyers to win the faceoff, and Farby will have it. Farby right in towards the right wing. Tries to look it over, now finding it over and open look to St. I. Win the shot! This one has been rejected. Brewster to win it! This one's been making the big news turn. York's got the puck. Here's a take for Farby. Over to Brewster! What a save again! Puck leaves the zone. Burns trying to hold on. And Bunny will have it over. Open look for a ball. Burns and save it once more. By Urson. There's a lot of heavy takes in between, but you've got to know, you've got a big feeling, you've got to make sure you're in set and control. Carolina wins the faceoff. Burns to win the game. This one's blocked there again. Nosen trying to find it over to get a Slavin. Slavin trying to work his way across to Kakemi. Kakemi to shoot. Trying to put a rebound, but this one's been stayed out. Five minutes remaining in the first OT. Off to York. Here's a chance for York to take it, and Fast will have it out. Lockton will try to clear that one puck out. Long game ahead, and we're under, we're just down to 430 to go. York to win the game. Kuchikov holds on, just like he does it before, and this one's not going to be easy enough if he gets there. And you're looking for the next game, we have a delay right now, as we have another one coming in here with you soon. So I'll be at 3.30 once again here for the Maple Leafs and the Pampers, that will be happening here at Scotia Bank Arena, if you're looking for a next game. Knows it to win the game, no, this would stay out. Oh, what a chance here for Nosen, that would have been a good one. And I'm going to win the game, no, it's staying again, again, but another time by Ursin. You say that Ursin was making it clear. That was happening. A lot of chance here to make the, make the win, but that one keeps on coming. They never really expect that Ursin was able to save that again. That was a close one. A lot of time left in this period. The Flyers are still making up some proud noises. Still a tie game, and now here's another one. Skeggy to win it. That was a blocker stop. And it's Fetchikov by Skeggy. Skeggy to win it. No, this would stay out. Ago now finds Teravainen, and Pesch will have it over to get to Skeggy. Here's a look for Teravainen. Pesch trying to work his way across. Teravainen fires a shot. Can't deflect it in there as Sechikov will try to put it back to Sechikov. Says you got to win! Put the rebound! This one's knocked away! Great point to be using a stick here as Ago will try to rebound it. It says back to halfway, 2.35 left to go. Toward the right wing, this one's left out. He's all alone! Clear to win! No! Another big stop by Erson. Oh my goodness, that was like the biggest one I was looking at it. That tacker's never going to come back in there if he's going to try to let it go forward. So Chikov just blocked the shot. Samuel back to Atkinson with 140 to go. And that one was carried out, no timing. 
Stegi, oh, here's a take. And Ersing will try to cover it up with no pass given to Martin. Huck. The fl flame of the, of the game, this one's still tied up. And the win, Stegi to win it, this one's blocked. Jarvis, shot, throw the rebound, it's knocked away. Just only one minute left to remain in the OT overtime. And this one will be coming into double overtime for the, for the third part of the season. We're hoping that this one might be turning to be okay for them. Tip it. What a great save here by Kuchikov. Jarvis with the puck. Loses control. Frost trying to look over it now. Skedgy. And pass broken up. Hawkinson to win. That went wide. Here's Frost. Takes a shot. What a stop by Kuchikov. And Jarvis will have it over. Time is running down. Jarvis. Will he have a chance to win it? No, that one stayed out. Oh my goodness, what a big save by Urson. This one's coming down there very right fast. And there's not a lot of time left for Urson to make that one with a close call. That big save is putting up big. What a what a tough one this is. And that will end the first regular overtime period in game four. No score in the game, but a lot of great chance for Hurricanes and Flyers as we go right to break. Double overtime is next. Second overtime about to begin here at Philadelphia with no score in the game for the win. Now we're ready. Here is Farby. He will have his chance now. Latin. Good stop by Kochikov. He's going to hold it up with just only 19.45 remaining in the second overtime period. They're still on their feet, looking for support to get a win. And the win puts it up. Check stopped again. Slavin now finding Terabinding. Terabinding, he's battling on the boards. And Svechikov will have it over. Now back to Burns. He'll try to give the pass back to Slavin. Over to Moons. Keep the puck back and forth. Shot! What a save by Ersing. The other side of it doesn't happen to be of a much clearer room, but there is no other take that it's going to be happening right between the line, and it's not really easy to take all that response in. They need some else to get from here. And a win for Carolina. That's blocked. Rebounded by Burns. Here's the take. Simon to win it. This one's been rejected. And here comes Farby. Farby will fire the puck out. Burns with the puck in control. Now finding a look at open look by Terabine. Forster can't hold on with that. This one's blocked out. Now rebound will put up by Brett Burns. Hurricanes moving their way forward right into the Flyers territory. With the fighting pass by Terabinian. Here's a take. Shot. This one's blocked out. And here's Slavin to win the game. No, oh, this one's necked out. And they still have it. Now Forster takes the puck over. Oh, that was a little bit big barrel roll over there. That is no way, Joe. I can't let that happen if there is another takeover. They really are trying to fire that one up. And here he comes. Racing to her between Lapton. Pulling it back. Lapton shot. Blocked. Now Slavin has that puck now by Nekis. Nekis makes his way to Bunning. Bunning right toward the right wing. Oh, that one's a big hit there. Jury shot. Can't, don't think the full slap shot will help. Senheim back the other way. Philadelphia working his way across. No quarter given here as it's the battle bringing for loose puck as he went down and Frost will have it. Bunning takes that back. Hesch will have it. Gives it over back to Nekis. Looking for a big lead. And Bunning. Look at the shot. Skelgy rebound. Big save by Ersin. Under 15 minutes in a, in a second overtime, it is still a tie game.
Cross wins the faceoff as Walker will have it. He finds Zeeler. Now he finds Tippett. Tippett trying to work his way across to Walker. Now Walker finds Atkinson. Now find Frost. Hold on for Zeeler. Big save by Kochikov. It's really not going to be easy enough when you try to take some a lot of time. You've got to make sure you're all set and prepared. You're never going to let that one get from here. And another stop by the goaltender for the Flyers. That's a big help there. They need to make sure they have that one cleared out. If they don't, then it's going to be like a hard time to get it through. Now the win. This one stopped. Here's Jarvis' shot. Back to Chatfield. Looks again. Orlov finding Jarvis. Jarvis to shoot. This one's wide. Looks fine again to Orlov. Orlov to shoot for again. That's another big save by Ursin. Oh, he's been doing really good now. Ursin's trying to like fight for it. He never wants to get tired out. He's really are into a full gas. Just make sure you, that he has a full stamina to take. It's going to be like a hard one that you would believe. Walker. Now finding the back again to Forster. Back to Zealer. Zealer working his way across, now finding it looking open. Forster to win it! Oh man, that was another big save up back there. And that one stopped by Kuchikov. Now they're ready to do another face off here. Just only 12 15 to go in the second overtime. Carolina wins the face off and now back to Orlov. Here's another one for Smetchikov. Smetchikov! Give the pass to again to Terabinen. And Ajo will try to live it out. Oh, I'm swing! That's blocked. Here's a take to Walker. Walker trying to find Lapton. Winning again? Nope, that won't take. And Ajo will have it over. Ajo sauce it over. That one's broken up. Looks like he's coming along. And Tara Biden will take the puck over. A lot of big upsets already, but this is what they need to do. They gotta keep on working it. Spurs to win it, and that one's broken up. Here's Forster. Trying to hold on with the puck stop, and it's saved off by Kuchikov. Off to Bunning. Bunning trying to work his way across. Forster takes the puck. No corner given up as they battle for the loose puck. Now trying to look for some open offense to give a good look by Bunny. And it's right over to Drury. And this one, there's the penalty! Oh boy! They're definitely going to have to bring an extra skater on. Well, the problem that happened to be this. It's not great way when you try to take a trip over someone. This is not how it's happening. And they're never going to lock that call. That's why it looks like the team Philadelphia is going to take all their time. Jury's in the penalty box. This will be a chance to win for the Flyers in the power play. Now they're ready to take one on. Flyers will they win in the fourth game. Now here's the win, Samuel shot, blocked by Skeggy. And Stahl will have it out. Now Tippett will give it over inside. Watching look over, here's Katara's shot. Great stop here in the chain. And Stahl will try to clear the puck out. Jarvis holds on, and there's an offside call for the Kings. Now they're about to do it again as they will prepare for another while the power play resumes. Tebow Terbiden wins the faceoff. While the power play's still on, he's trying to cut a cut. Bruno trying to pick the slap. What a big save here. Bowling up already, right from the board. And finding that just won't appear. Now the time is coming down for one minute for, for Flyers. This one stopped. Chatfield have it on the other side of the range. He goes over it. Don't take it away from me. That's no more offensive on that way because they're really trying to let that one slam down. 
We're going to have a lot of hard time to get this one for him. Don't let that question concern up there. They really are making a lot of pay for on what they need. They really need to get this one over time. Here's Boating. Shot. Can't hold on. Looks like his time's almost about to expire. Harvey to win it. No, it stayed out again. Oh, big save. That's a close call. Brand just no more optional because that one turned it over to be like a hard one to go in between the big gaps of the zone. Gotta take some more time if you can get there. And that one's way off the mark. Here's another one for Slavin. Slavin shoots. Good save. 7-17 left to go in the second overtime. A lot of big upset moments. And a win. And this one's blocked. Svechikov gives again to Burns. Here's Burns to win it. Oh, and a big stopper here by the goaltender. Turn shot. Way wide. Close to calling out finding Slavin. And a take the tear line in. Broken up the pass. A lot of great plays in between. And here comes Farby. He will have his own time. Here's Sebastian Ajo, he will give off to Tara Vining. And here's the breakaway, Svechikov. Whoa, almost went in there. Oh, big save. Philadelphia back in the offense zone, trying to pick up this score. This one can't hold on. Svechikov will try to handle it out. Takes a shot, trying to put it in. Here's Tara Vining. Slavin. Burns, Svechikov to win, that's behind the net. Here's Atkinson. Atkinson trying to roll it inside with five minutes to go. And a take right now for Tara Vinen. Tara Vinen to go for the win, it's blocked, what a stop. Ertz is gonna take some time right now with only 4.45 to go in a second overtime. And they have the win. Slavin to win it. Off the mask, and it's a big, big number save. Slavin finding Burns. Burns to win it. Shoots. And put a rebound. Stopped out of here. What a great defensive recovery. They really are having a lot of difficulty ranging out there. They need to find a little bit more room. Oh, never stop. York will now have it over on the other side. And here's Atkinson. Tired group defensive bins are working very hard. And it's still close out. Valley for the loose puck of the chain. Atkinson to win the game? No! This one's kept out. And Stahl will have it. Should put up a win. Oh, big save! Oh my goodness. We're going to be here that long. Oh, really? They really are trying to make that win feel like we were all in pursuit? That is no question. No concerns. Nothing. And now for the Flyers winning the faceoff back again to Sam Hine. Here's Hathaway, you will have his chance. Can't take the puck from him. Patch. We'll have to fire it out of here, and this one will be clear. And this one may be going for play motion. Here he comes. That one's way wide. The full pressure's on as Walker will have that puck in range. Back to pulling. Pulling, trying to work his way up. Drury trying to hold the puck with that. Half away with the defensive zone, now finding Walker. And here's Pulling. Give a good slap run here. Here's Drury to defend it. Over to Nekis. Drury trying to hold on with that. Nekis can't hold on. And Farby will have it. Farley trying to take his own time. The pass given up too quickly. One minute remaining in second overtime. This one's coming down right toward the wire, guys. It's going to be a long one. Well, let's try and see. I think the third overtime could be a start range to the back. Svechikov can't hold on with the puck. He now finds Drury. Turbine in. Over now is Svechikov. Blocked out. Fast. Big save by Ersin. Oh, and Drury will have it. 
with a shot to Ramona Grubsain! Unbelievable! Urson still on fire. There's no quick gear for Philadelphia. You're never going to get that one well easy enough if you can win that one. The time running down. Chatfield. Win the back end. Trying to put a rebound in and it's knocked out. And Walker will have his own time. We are going to a third overtime as it's stopped again by the goaltender. And this one will end here. Third overtime's coming up after the break. Two overtime shut down, but this might be for the third. Be back after this. It's the third overtime for the first time in the postseason. And we are off to go. It has been so long right now, and we are trying to find out who wins this game. Let's find out who takes it here. I have whatever it takes for you guys, with yours in between. Well, they were not really playing it so hard and well aggressive, they were really are trying to make its way through. The better offense is not picking up the way that they were supposed to. But this was a great day that really happened to be all for anybody who has taken over. I really love the hustle in the mountain, and this is taking a lot of time, but they could just try to keep it going. Ogno shot, blocked it up here, and Sandheim being back to Farby. And Farby will have that one in there. Ogno gets the stretcher call, back to Ogno. And Terrible who has it. He went down. Now Burns will have it over here and give again to Svechikov. Here on the left side of the wing, now finding again Ogno. Ogno racing in towards the right, left side. Trying to give up the slap in. It's safe, puts in by Ursin. Ogno give it over again. And Farby takes a puck steal. Closes the gap out. Now here's Ogno. Looking to get his third eye. Finding to score it. And no, that one stopped by Ersing. We're going to be here all night. And you're never going to know what's going to happen like that. Now the fishes are ready to take its way down towards its wire. Still tie game. And now it's tossed up as Sketchy will have it over. Here's another one for Pesh. Pesh now will find again the Sketchy. Find again the Pesh. Puts it back to Drury. Drury holding on to it. Gives again the Pesh. Now finding Sketchy. Sketchy shoots! Pull it in there! The rebound! That picked it up right away! Oh, what a big stop by Erickson! He's not going anywhere tonight! Wow! Forster, another stop made here by Kuchikov. The puck will lead the zone. And Sandheim will have it over now again. Here comes Nekis. His team's in the way! Great stop by York. And with the poke check, now back again to Atkinson. And Bunny will have his own chance. The airway inbound, now finding another way open look. Here's Stahl. On his way down, finding Pesh. Here's another way for Sketchy. Sketchy finds a pass to Stahl. Stahl gives it back to Pesh, and now he finds Sketchy. Win the game! The back end! Save the game by Erson. Erson's doing really well. Just trying to make sure he's so good. Jarvis to win it. No, oh, that one's staying out. And for the winning shot, it's one step, he scores! Good night, Flyers! Hurricanes shut out in Philadelphia, a 3-2 win. And what a celebration! They earned their victory spot into the next round. It's what all happens for Jordan Martin who takes his own rebound and he lights up the game. The first round comes to a shock and awe and he is done. So long Flyers. It has been a wild night. Wow. And I have got to tell you, they played hard, but farewell Flyers until for the next part of the season. Well, it's been a long night already, and I am just telling you, it's been a great game. Thank you all for joining us, and with that being said, this is Test Tube along with Fan, and across here is Ultra Beast, along with Son of Beast, the original man. 
This has been a presentation of the NHL Stanley Cup Playoffs on EA Sports. Thanks for joining with us. We'll see you again next time. All right, thank you guys so much. What a long game this is. If you guys have already watched it and made it to the end, thank you all so much for already being here. And if those of you who have didn't, you can definitely watch it again soon. Like no matter what day or night you go with, it's just the one thing that goes with some a lot of it, better techniques. Now let's have a look for the three star plays in the game. Third star goes all to anybody who has that one in. But if Sebastian Ava with two goals in the game, but the second star as he goes the other way is Borja Korchakov with 46 saves. He's done it really well, been taking a lot of time. And your first star player of the game goes to Samuel Arison. He has been almost taking a hundred saves of his night, but his time has already came down. Flyers are eliminated in the playoffs. Here's how you do with the total statistics. 97 over 48, but it was 78 over 46 for Flyers. 26-42 over 548 for Carolina. Then it was 89% over 79% for the passing of Flyers. 43 face-off wins for the Carolina Hurricanes, and both teams have received a penalty kill with no shot goals for the power play and four-minute power play minutes. So that is it for game four for Philadelphia and the Carolina Hurricanes, as they will be facing against the winning team in Eastern Conference in between the New York Rangers and the Bolts. The next game that we have is the Toronto Maple Leafs and the Panthers. That's going to be coming up in just a minute. Just a couple minutes, and we will get you back down here on our way with our next commentary. Peace out, folks, for a while as the NHL Stanley Cup playoffs on EA Sports Style. This is Boomer, thanking you for joining with us. So long and good night in Philadelphia. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.